At more than 348 square miles and serving more than 64,000 students, Conroe Independent School District is the largest school district in Montgomery County, the 11th largest school district in Texas, and the 65th largest school district in the nation. CISD is home to seven high schools, three ninth grade campuses, seven junior high schools, 10 intermediate schools, three alternative education centers, and 34 elementary schools, a total of 64 campuses. Conroe ISD grows on average by 1,300 to 1,500 students annually. This is more students per year than the entire enrollment of approximately 70% of the school districts in Texas. To sustain this rapid growth and maintain its current facilities, which are an average of 28 years old, the Board of Trustees, by a vote of 6 to 0, called a bond election for November 5, 2019. The district's voters will see two propositions on the November 5th ballot one relating primarily to construction, renovation, safety, and security, and the other for artificial turf at the district's high schools. Here's what you need to know about the two propositions on the November 5th ballot. Proposition A includes four new elementary schools and one new junior high school in the fastest growing areas of the district. Two new elementary schools are planned for the Caney Creek High School feeder zone. One will provide enrollment relief for Creighton, Austin, and Milam Elementary schools, and the other will address the projected growth near San Jacinto Elementary. The Caney Creek feeder zone is also the location of the new junior high school. The third elementary school, a K-6 campus, will be built in the Conroe High School feeder zone to reduce student enrollment at Stewart, Giesinger, and Cryer. The fourth elementary school will be in the Grand Oaks High School feeder zone to relieve crowding at Snyder and Broadway elementaries. Without these new schools, the district will be forced to rezone students more frequently and across high school feeder zones to campuses that are not experiencing the same level of rapid growth. Proposition A also includes adding general instruction classrooms at College Park High School, career and technical education, engineering, science classrooms at the Woodlands High School, and expanding fine arts and athletic spaces to meet the needs of the increased enrollment at Caney Creek High School. Students in South County will no longer need to travel to Conroe High School to access the district's only automotive technology program. A facility at Oak Ridge High School will serve as the South County Automotive Technology Center and be a hub for district-level technical and engineering programs. Oak Ridge High School, a 38-year-old building, will also receive improvements to its air conditioning, electrical, and plumbing systems. York Junior High and the Conroe High School 9th grade campus will receive additions to address current and future capacity issues. York Junior High is currently at 115% building capacity. Several of the district's older campuses that do not have gymnasiums will receive dedicated PE classrooms, giving students at Runyon Elementary and both Wilkerson and Collins Intermediates more opportunities to engage in physical activity. Proposition A also includes funds for safety and security enhancements at Conroe ISD schools. Projects include upgraded security cameras, first responder radio signal amplifiers, emergency generators, exterior door sensors, and required upgrades to fire alarm systems. To transport its growing student population, the district needs more buses. Currently, the district transports over 37,000 students to and from school each day. The average age of the district's 550-plus bus fleet is 11.4 years old, and 131 buses do not have air conditioning. Proposition A includes funds for more buses that come with seatbelts and air conditioning. The district has also run out of space to park its fleet, so funds to expand its Conroe Transportation Center are also included, along with funds for technology infrastructure. Proposition B includes the installation of artificial turf at Oak Ridge, College Park, Conroe, Caney Creek, and the Woodlands High Schools. Artificial turf allows the over 15,000 students participating in athletics, JROTC, band, cheer, physical education classes, and drill team to use fields for their activities on a more consistent basis. If both propositions are approved by CISD voters, it is not anticipated that taxpayers will see a tax rate increase. This is largely due to the growth, current favorable interest rate environment, the district's ability to refund current bonds at lower interest rates, and ongoing reductions of the district's existing debt. Conroe ISD has consistently maintained the lowest school district tax rate in Montgomery County and one of the lowest in the greater Houston area. The Board of Trustees approved the tax rate for this year at $1.23 per $100 of assessed valuation, a rate 5 cents lower than last year. CISD continues to be recognized for being a good steward of its taxpayers' dollars. The Education Resource Group named Conroe ISD the second most productive school district in Texas based on its academic outcomes for students and its financial efficiency for taxpayers. 
According to Texas Smart Schools, CISD is one of only two of the 1,100 plus public school districts in Texas to be recognized with a five-star rating 10 years in a row for high academic achievement while maintaining cost-effective operations. Conroe ISD was also named one of the top 200 employers in the state of Texas by Forbes. A list of polling sites for dates for both early voting and on election day can be found on the district's website at conroeisd.net slash bond, along with more information about the November 5th, 2019 CISD bond referendum.